Hello, I'm Ann Stevens, film critic from the Northport Star. And I'm Steve Jones, film critic from the Port Charlotte Globe. Welcome to Movie Talk, where Ann and I discuss the latest films. Steve, our first film is an independent feature called The End of the Affair. I found this picture to be straightforward and true to life, capturing the nuances, the setback of today's modern relationships. I especially identified with the female character, Ingrid, and her struggle to save a relationship that was clearly doomed and sabotaged by Ian, the male central character who only focused on himself. Hello? Sound familiar? Ingrid's struggle to save the relationship. Really, did we even see the same film, Anne? Uh, by the way, you're the one that's self-obsessed. Your BFF is your own reflection. Well, movie boy, I thought the character's dialogue was witty and realistic. Forced and phony, more like it, vanity girl. You didn't like the dialogue, Steve, because you don't listen. Men don't listen. They don't. It's just common knowledge. Uh, see, uh, uh, what's that? I didn't hear a single word you said, and that's just common knowledge. Steve Jones, you get the Irving Thalborg Award for being a jerk. Oh, yeah? Well, you don't even know who Irving Thalborg was. Yeah, he's some guy in movies um, from a long time ago. Hmm. Just like a child. Well, I'm the adult in this relationship. Even in this show, I select the films, I schedule the film shoot, I even bring brownies for the crew. Well, you do it all, don't you? Next week, we'll review the new Wonder Woman movie. Not the one starring Gal Gadot, but the one starring you because you're perfect, just like Wonder Woman. I would be an awesome choice for Wonder Woman movie boy. Uh, yeah, because Wonder Woman is the only superhero who's not totally stuck on herself. Well, Steve, you can replace Paul Rudd in the new Ant-Man movie without Paul's wit or considerable charm. They'd have to get a stand-in for that. Maybe Ryan Gosling is available. Yeah, uh, wait, wasn't Ant-Man the first movie we saw together? Yeah, and you said the cutest thing. Since we were not scheduled to review the film, we just saw it on our own time. And you said, welcome to Off the Clock Cinema. Oh, I just thought that was darling. It was funny and sweet. Oh, yeah, it was a throwaway line. What can I say? I'm a film critic. And a fine one at that. Back at you, girl. Sorry about all the snipes. I'm sorry, too. I guess I'm just having a bad day. Join us next week when Steve and I review several films, including Get a Room, You Two, and Staying Together, where a couple tries one more time to make it work. And work it out they will. I hope it's a comedy. A romantic comedy? Well, just as long as it's not a slasher film. Yikes! I'm a film geek. Couldn't help but reference Hitchcock's Psycho. Well, thank you for joining us on Movie Talk. I'm Steve Jones. And I'm Ann Stevens. And remember, when you talk about movies, talk about Movie Talk. And when you watch movies, watch our show. That was covered in my Movie Talk sign-off, Steve. Well, as a legendary Groucho Marx would say, I'll quit while I'm behind. Well played, Steve Jones. Well played.